Hi folks, welcome back to Edible Whole Foods. Well, you know, we've been talking about the great agricultural possibilities in the state of North Carolina this month. Grown, raised, made, and today, caught. Caught. This is Renee Stewart. She is the co-owner with her brother of Taylor Fish Farm. Taylor Fish Farm, that's you correct. you guys raised tilapia. Right, and we're... You're, tell us where you are. Okay, we're located in Northern Orange, uh, not far from the Caswell Line, uh -huh. and we raise our tilapia in a recirculating system. Uh, it's a very unique system. It uh, suspends, it has rapid solid removals, uh, which takes about a minute and a half, and we have a complete water exchange every 40 minutes. So that's, that's what awesome. it has improved our taste. We have an excellent taste for our tilapia. Tilapia. Uh, tilapia, I'd also like to mention, we have a special diet that boosts the omega-3 in our tilapia. Uh, tilapia is high in selenium and vitamin B12. Well, and, uh, tilapia, I call tilapia a beginner's fish because it takes on so many different flavors. Right. And it's a great fish for people to that think they don't like fish, they like tilapia. It does have a mild flavor. And unfortunately, folks, a lot of the tilapia up until you guys have started doing this, it comes from overseas, so to have a local source, I think is, is really phenomenal. And it really is. Great. And y'all are doing all the things to make it a better fish and, and better tasting and better for the environment, all of that. Exactly, so. it's a fully sustainable system and uh, we they're best fed. We have the best tasting tilapia. Well, let's see how Come we on. make it taste. Okay. All right. So anyway, we've got a whole tilapia. All right. Which I think a lot of people are a little afraid of whole fish, but they're really pretty simple to cook, and they're great on the grill. They are. And we're going to be very, very, I agree with very, you. very simple. So I've got some thyme, and all I'm doing is stuffing this down in the cavity. By the way, the fishmongers at Whole Foods will take care of all the pesky little stuff in here that you don't want to know about. I'm going to put some rosemary in there, and I'm also going to put in some oregano, and then just a couple of pieces of lemon. They can hang out. That's fine. If you want some basil, you can put basil in here. You could put limes in here. You could do about anything you want. And if my trusty assistant will hand me that olive oil right there, that's right underneath. Thank you, trusty assistant. We're gonna drizzle it with a little olive oil. All right, make sure your grill is clean and fairly hot. And we're just gonna take this thing and put it right on the grill and let it be cooking. So, I got one already cooked over here. Okay, let's you, you do think the we taste. To, you think we ought to try it? I think so, let's have the taste test. Look at how beautiful that fish is cooked. Isn't that wonderful in there? And it's not a bony fish either. Mm. Great taste. Picks up that charcoal flavor. It does, really. Very mild, but you can you can kind of taste the herbs that are coming through and the lemons. Thank y'all so much. Great taste. I know this was a gamble to do it. We appreciate what you're doing. Buy some tilapia caught in North Carolina. Come back Thank to see you. us next time on Edible Whole Foods.